Here's what he told his uh, battalion leaders. The, the leadership inside the battalion. If you take care of your soldiers, they'll take care of you. According to Battle Company's Lieutenant Carl Olson, an OCS gr draftee who is sharp as a Hinson custom knife, the rules were simple. Check weapons, check feet, show that you care, and let the troops know if we get into deep shit, help will be on the way. I used every second, every day to train and instill discipline. Beginning with something as basic as making sure every man wore his steel pot and carried his weapons at all. What's up, Dirty Cones? Uh, Jocko Willink, this week's uh, podcast, Steal My Soldier's Hearts, uh, with uh, Colonel Hackworth, uh, talking about his time in Vietnam and leadership type stuff. And I like it, and it's good. Um, going back through it because I wanted to share that little part. Mission first means people first. You take care of your people, your people take care of you, and the mission will get done. And, and I think that's what's important. Um, but everybody's got, you know, there, there are different times where, you know, someone says, well, mission first has got to come mission first. Yes, there, there are times, you know, before personal desires and comforts, that kind of mission first. But making sure your people are trained, prepared, and ready adds people first which will ultimately lead to mission first um, so I am working on converting the audio I wish you guys could have been there in uh, Jimmy O'Fallon uh, Illinois he had like there's a little video because you know me and my cameras they don't work very well um, so there was a good like 15-20 minutes to how we started to warm up and then we did the podcast, I guess we'll call it, um, or vodcast, and then, but they only got like eight minutes, and then there's a seven minute break, and then I got 40 minutes of us talking, which is the, the bulk of uh, the conversation between Sean and I, and, and uh, some questions and answers with the uh, Conefit guys, and then, um, and then we turned off because I felt bad because uh, I was like, man, these guys have been sitting for a long time. So we, uh, and nobody moved. So we stopped the podcast and just went into conversation. And the conversation went on another hour and a half. So um, it was good. These guys asked the right questions and uh, I actually didn't get to answer all their questions. Um, somebody asked me about meditation the other day. And there, there's different, you know, there's Western meditation is prayer. You know, uh, meditation is just being quiet, being mindful of where you're at, um, being in your head, being in your body, and, you know, <sighs> breathing and relaxing and, and doing what you're supposed to be doing. So, I think um, it's not hard, just sit quietly. To me, underwaters are a form of meditation. Uh, you're suffering in silence, and you're learning, and you're growing, and you're getting better. Um, but you're not gonna be able to do that unless you know you engage, and uh, you must engage the enemy, and the enemy is yourself. <laughs> so, defeat the inner dirty cone that says no, no, this is no fun. We can't do it, and uh, release the inner cone. That, uh, that knows he can. So listen to that voice. Because you're uh, American, not American. Uh, unless you're not American, uh, then you can be Mexican or Mexican. <laughs> I know he's reading again. So I, I'll just glance at my notes. Ready? Oh. Nope, not the question I wanted. Alright. <laughs> uh, second question. How do I nurse an injury? All right. It depends. How bad are you hurt? How bad does it feel? You know your body. Like, was it all of a sudden, ooh? Or, you know, like I said, you did legs yesterday, so you're a little sore. Um, give it a day or two. If it goes longer than a week, you know, you might be injured. So it might be time to get that thing checked out. If you, um, You'll, you should know, you know, 
soreness is kind of a large area muscle group injury tends to be specifically you know unless something's broke or you know you tore your whole labrum off um, not pinpoint but a little bit more uh, exact so that's another way to tell if it hurts bruising <laughs> swelling uh, blood pooling things like that. that that might give it away too um yeah, so the the cone fit guys were pretty awesome. Like they um, they had their shit together, and I, I was very impressed with their idea of teamwork um, because it's it's everything that I think teamwork should be, and, uh, and they're just doing the right thing. So that's all you gotta do: do the right thing, attract other like-minded individuals or looking to do the right thing, you know, make a pod, make a clan, and then, uh, destroy everything in your way, that's what you gotta do, every day, Dirty Cones, destroy obstacles, not people, <laughs> so, uh, just a quickie, and that's it, so listen to Jungle Willink this week, amazing every week uh i really like how he does the book club i mean I, I would like to do that i don't know if uh if i can now i'll figure it out anyway so thank you very much for listening and i'll chat with you later yeah